over from um, Anna Louise. I'll stick a little clip in so you guys can check it out and see it. If you're not familiar with Anna Louise, it's a, a company that makes sustainable um, uh, jewelry. It's uh, planet friendly. Uh, it's made from gold plated, plated gold, plated silver, and uh, I'll put the link below so y'all can look it up. But this is this is beautiful, beautiful, and it's three separate necklaces. Y'all will see in the clip. Okay, guys, this is how the package came to me. It had a little card. I was going too fast, and then it has a little pouch for the first necklace. So pretty, so pretty. This is beautiful. This is how the first one looks. That's beautiful. Beautiful. And then the second item comes in this little package with Anna Luis. And it's a cute, cute little heart. Really pretty. Really pretty. And it says it's a uh, size 16. I guess that's the length of it. And the, the little hold, the heart on the one side, it looks gold. I just accidentally flipped it. And I noticed that the other side looks like little diamonds. That's beautiful. And then the last item is just a chain necklace. Hi YouTube, it's your girl Raquel and I'm back out with a huge Sephora and other haul. Yeah, I have been meaning to get this up since I got back but the cleaning that has not taken place as of yet because I got all of this stuff sitting around I haven't got a, a Victoria's Secret haul over there I just need to get this stuff up and share with you guys so I can put it up once I put it up I can start cleaning up but anyway y'all if y'all ready for a long haul, go get you a snack or something. Turn the TV up so you can, you know, walk around and clean up. Because y'all, this is going to be a long one. A long one. <laughs> okay, guys. Before we get into the haul, let me just get this out the way. Let me get this stuff here out the way. This is not stuff I bought. This is stuff I ordered on Oxily. I'll put a link below if you are a, a YouTuber. Just go to the Oxley, apply, and they kind of send you stuff over that you can, hey, check out and try and, you know, see what it be about. Okay, this is the only thing I have from Oxley, and it's all Clarence, and I love Clarence skincare. We're going to just run through it real quick. The first thing I got is the uh, lip oil shimmer. I already know what this is because I already have a couple of these from before and it's just a lip oil and it has color to it y'all yeah it's real moisturizing i got a peach one a tan one and um yeah i just use these at night and especially you know this one i'll probably use in daytime because it's got more color and it's kind of shimmery shout out to clarence for sending this over to your girl i got here is this was sent all together in a double set. I already know what this is. And y'all probably seen this on this channel before. And this is the uh, total eye lift. I've been using this for a while. I already know it's in a red. Yep. Yep. I've already gone through one. And I'm working on another one now. This is the total eye lift concentrate. Uh, lift replenish. It's lift and replenishing. Replenishing, replenishing. Some little eye rolls I got under there. I don't know why replenishing won't come out. That don't come out right. But yeah, I've been using it to work on them little eye rolls, them little eye lines. 
to get them down and I, I'm liking that I, it keep popping up and I keep ordering it um, so I can keep trying it so I like this it keeps popping up on Oculus so you get it but anyway okay I, I'm really loving it okay anyway y'all don't care about that the extra firm energy glow plus complex now this is new to me that's that's new I, I'm not familiar with this a glow plus complex cream oh okay so I'm guessing this is a facial cream or a facial moisturizer that gives you glow okay see this here would be in my nighttime so, uh, extra firming energy oh wrinkle control day cream oh let me open this up because I just finished my uh my uh Elemis face cream and I really liked it and I was on the fence and thinking about buying it. I just finished it this morning. I used the last the last of it. Ooh. I was thinking like as in a shiny glow. But I think this is gonna be hmm. Okay, I'll let you guys know. I will let you guys know because this will be on my I'm gonna have to use it every day until the Sephora sale. Cause I'm put, yeah, I'm going back to Sephora. What y'all mean? <laughs> I'm addicted. Okay, okay. And the last thing in this clearance collection is the double serum hydrolonic lip hydro hydric hydric and lipidic simpson. <laughs> Liptic system, liptic, okay. <laughs> Double serum, it's got hydrolonic acid and lipids, is what I'm thinking. It says system. It says, uh, let me see what this is. Oh, double serum, it's a serum, so it's got lipids and hydrolonic acid. Yes, yes, okay, yeah, okay. I think the bathroom gonna be the first place that I start. That's what it looks like. Oh, it want to get on my face when I move this out the way. But y'all see it. This look like it's going to be good. What is it supposed to do? Where is the English? The only bio-infused anti-aging serum with two phases. Hydric, which is water-soluble, and lip, lip, that's what it is. Lipidic. Lipidic oil which is soluble hmm this is the first time it decodes the language of youth oh boosting the skin's five virtual functions now it's a double serum i can't hardly see it y'all i know i can't combine now a double serum combines 20 plus potent age control plant extracts including turmeric extract rich in turmeric to effectively target visible signs of aging. Firm and visibly reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles and improve radiance, even skin tones, and reduces the appearance of pores. Yes! Okay, I got excited. I got excited. Okay, this is starting on my rotation tonight. Now, of course, we all know I didn't do no, no skincare because I'm... I'm I'm overflowing and it looks to be working, girl, because I still feel like I'm about, well, I feel like I look like about, about 30. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's do a uh, first show. Okay, what I got here is for my hair. This is the Bondi Boost. I got the whole system. The whole system. I saw somebody here on uh, YouTube talking about it, and I went to Ulta uh, Reviews. And it says it was really good. It's a uh, Bundy Boost HG shampoo. It's salon professional, Australian made, paraben sulfate, silicon free, vegan friendly, and cruelty free. And it's supposed to help your hair grow. It says ready for better hair days. This Zetsy peppermint scented shampoo will help you get three. Will help you get there. Made with signature peppermint, rosemary, and rosemary. It will have you coming back for more. Okay. Okay. No silicones, no parabens, no sulfates. That's what this is. That's the shampoo. I ain't going to read them all. We'll be here all night. And I got a lot of stuff to go through. And then I got the conditioner. It says the same thing. 
and it it has uh no silicone no oh, oh peppermint rosemary and stinging needle hmm. peppermint rosemary and stinging needle n e t t l e both of them have the same ingredients so I'm gonna use this from now until I, if it's not gone by December because I only wash my hair once a week then we'll we'll take a look back because right now I just you know I still got that little bit of rough yeah. And then I got the uh, Bundy Boost Miracle Hair Mask. It says treat your hair where treat your hair from where it grows with nutritious oil, including argon, uh, a bison, macadamia. Yeah, I can't see that macadamia, macadamia, castor oil, a jojoba, and plus it smells like candy cane. <laughs> I gotta smell this. Oh, it do. Smell like candy canes. That's what it looks like. But it's a hair mask. That's what it looks like. And again, I only wash my hair once a week. So we're going to see if I get any more hair. I was trying to see her whole oil. Oh, I already told you I was in it. Castor oil. That's what I'm liking. And the last thing from this line I got is the uh, Bondi Boost Intensive Spray. And it's the same thing. No parabens, no sulfate, no silicones. It has peppermint oil, tea tree essential oil, and it says it's lightweight. It has, oh, vitamin B5, peppermint, and tea tree. That's what it says. And it's just a leave-in spray. So I'll probably use this every day until it's gone. It says spritz directly into your scalp and gently massage with fingers. Apply once a day. To wet or dry hair. Yeah, I'll use this once a day. We're going to see what this Bondi Boost do. Yeah, see, this guy ain't supposed to be in here. Well, this just, this ain't, is this just for men? And, you know, it kind of worked for women, too. Around, you know, you know, your hair get to act and find it doing crazy. Cut. Anyway, let's move on. The next thing I got in here. Oh, I forgot about these. I thought I left them. Man, y'all, this is not from all to this pearl. I think I got this uh in Houston. I know I got it in Houston. What's the name of the store? Marshalls at Marshalls. $31.99. Y'all, this is Vera Wang. Kelly asked me about this and was like, I was like, girl, you got the Vera Wang in Marshalls? Girl, I smelled it and it's the Vera Wang for $31. A big bottle. And she was like, you want it? I was like, yeah. She's like, here you go. I was like, girl, thank you. <laughs> and I put it in this bag, I guess. And this was just a no. I don't, I never heard of this. Element Edition Pearl. And it's, uh, it was $14.99 in Marshalls. Okay, this is the only thing I'm going to get off of. But both of these, y'all know about Earl Wayne. Earl Wayne is delicious. Girl, it's delicious. And this pearl I had never heard or smelt. Man, it's just a slow, airy, fresh. It smells like fresh morning air. That's what it smells like. Fresh morning air in a bottle. So, I guess I just put them in here. But, let's keep going. Since we on perfumes, and I got two in here. Y'all, this was a must get for me. I didn't even know this existed. I went to restock this since I didn't take it with me. So, I just went to get a bottle that I would have. You know, they're with me. Girl. And I walked in that store and I saw this smart shaker. Intense. It's the perfect intense now. I was not aware. I don't know how I didn't get the notification. But girl. Ooh, look at the bottle. It's so pretty. This is the this is the regular perfect. This is the regular one. And this is the intense. Oh, it's darker too. I don't remember since I didn't open it. So let's just spray a little bit. Ooh. 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 It smells like the perfect, but it's a little bit more <laughs> intense. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's the way to explain it or describe it. If you ever smell perfect, this is a little bit more intense. I wonder does it last longer too? Okay. Let's let's keep going. Let's keep going. I don't know what was up with me. I went on a, a perfume kick and I picked up uh Valentino. 
let me tell y'all, when I smelled this, I was like, this is a scent I have to have anyway. Oh, this is a sexy bottle. This is really sexy. Let's see. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, I remember. I remember. It's not my normal scent. Because I like them grown and sexy. Late night club. Ooh, but that smelled good. I think it was mixing. That was mixing. I like it. I like it. I knew I liked it when I smelled it in the store. But you know how you smell something in the store when you get home, it don't smell the same. But yeah, this is Valentino Donnie. Donna. Did I say that right? I said Donnie, but it's Valentino Donna. Oh, let me share this with y'all. I found this in um Ulta as well. And this is a, a natural sugar wax. It says it's 100% vegan. And look, guys, you do not have to heat this wax up. You can pull it, you know, just scrape it out of the thing. Or you can put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds. And this stuff wax just as good as my wax. I forgot my waxing kit because, you know, you don't want to put all that in the hotel. So I went looking for something that wasn't a waxing kit so I could, you know, get rid of this here and this look. You know, all this extra hair that be going on in my fascia area. And this is perfect. If y'all having that same issue, check this out. Check this out. Let me put it up close. I got it at Ulta. I don't even think it was that expensive. Maybe $14. Maybe. Maybe $14. Yeah. So, <laughs> these are just essentials. I brought, you know, you know, I forgot to bring my, um, for my lashes. And I forgot to bring my, um, eyebrow archer. But it was pointless because, you know, I really didn't get to use none of this stuff. So, that's that. Okay. How long have we been going, y'all? 15 minutes. Let me move on. Oh, Lord, that is not Ulta, guys. I forgot. This is going to be a long video. Makeup for last. Now, this stuff, y'all, I ain't even got to take out the box. Because every time I order from Ulta, okay, I'm going to take it out. I'm going to take it out just because I feel funny not taking it out. Now, let's get into it. Okay. I tell y'all, every time I, I get something from Ulta or I order from Ulta, Y'all know I always get this Knip, the bath oil. This time I got the, uh, this is, I think it's, what kind, what kind is this? Uh, Valerine and Hoops. That's what this is. I haven't tried this because I always get the, uh, oh, jeez. Oh, it's blue. Oh, I did try this. This was in the, the set that initially helped me. My chair just went down. Let's try this again. Anyway, I tried this in the set. I think it was all the, the uh, scents that they have. It's essential oils. And I like the eucalyptus the most. And that's what I've been buying all year. So, um, I decided to try the uh, Valerine and Hoops. And I'm sure that I also got the... I did. I also got the bath salts. And Valerine and hoops. That's a pretty blue. Yeah, I cannot wait to take a soaker in there. I'm gonna smell these because I love the eucalyptus. That's what I couldn't think of. I don't know about that. That smell like mints and it smell like Valerine, but it smell earthy, like something essential. How about that? Okay. It don't hurt to step out and try something. But I did get, I also picked up my favorite, the eucalyptus bubble bath and the eucalyptus uh, uh, salts, bath salts. Absolutely love them. Absolutely love them. And then the last ones I got in there was the lavender and vanilla bubble bath and the lavender uh, bath salts. This, if you into taking them soaker baths and relaxing your mind and clearing your thoughts, you got to try. You got to try those. I, I got a whole wall of Bath and Body Works in my bathroom around my tub that I don't use, haven't used in a year because I constantly, I just love that. Okay, let's keep moving. Okay, apparently I really do love the eucalyptus because... <laughs> I got the bath oil too, and I know I do. 
I just didn't know I got it and I'm glad I did. So I got the bubble bath, the bath salts, and the bath oil. Talking about clearing your sinuses, your mind, your brain. Okay, I'm going to get on off of that and move on. I don't know how or why this is in here. But I guess it was a free gift. But I'm cool. I'm not, I'm not mad at it. Oh. It says it's a coach fragrance bag. Okay. I didn't buy any Coach Fragrance stuff, so I don't know. Maybe it was a mistake because I was going to get that. I think it's Coach Dreams, but I didn't get it because I didn't like the way it smelled. So that's neither here nor there. Okay. Now we can move into what's else in here. I got the Bio Blender by Eco Tools. I had one last year that was a mixed, it said plant-based. Oh, okay. Plant me. Oh. 100% certified biodegradable sponge. USDA certified natural engaged 100% plantable paper packaging. Okay. We're going to save our earth for a flawless complexion. I will let you guys know how that works. I got four pair. Oh, wait, I got a brush. I got two brushes. I got two brushes. I got this little F uh, travel brush. That's what it looks like. Yeah, I had to take all my bigger brushes. And then, I don't know, something. I don't know. I saw somebody with this brush and I was like, oh, I need that little brush. You know how that is. It was on somebody on YouTube. But anyway, I know I love the Real Techniques brushes. They are great, great, great brushes and they last forever. I got a lot of them that I've had for a while. A while. I just dug that brush up for nothing. I got four pair of lashes. Uh, the Sister Nature Lashes by Kiss. These are... Uh, that's supposed to be biodegradable. Yeah. Yeah. Printed with soy ink. Even the packaging is um, earth friendly. Y'all. Ooh, look at them. Girl, not these. These. Ooh. See, the picture didn't look like that. So when y'all see me over here, back my eye like my head gonna fall. Y'all uh notice these glasses. I mean these lashes. It's not good to buy everything online. But we saving the earth, right? Okay. And then I had to go against the grain. And I got uh, MLBB. I guess this is another new set of Kiss lashes. And that's all I know is MLBB. I'm going to bring it up close. So real and blessed. I know I had to get that's so real. And that's blessed. Okay. All right, girl. And then I have, oh, I got another pair of lashes. This is Kish Culture Matte Black. Oh, it says new. So, ooh, yeah, I didn't buy these. This say like from the Faux Mink Collection. Black is black is the color. Yeah, I didn't buy these. I don't know what I was looking at. Them lashes are huge. Look at her. That look like for Halloween night. Girl, it's a 3D volume. Okay, I'm gonna have to take some scissors to them and trim them down because y'all that, that's too much lash. That, that's too much. Okay, we ain't gonna go through all of these, but I got some um these are the LA Girl liners. If you have ever tried LA Girl liners, yeah, all of them are LA Girl. I got turquoise, blue, black. And I think this is the new the, the newer version that came out with. I don't know why I got two blacks, a blue, a green. Okay, y'all can see me with green liner. Y'all gonna know what's up with that. And a brown. I know why I got this brown because they brown melt so good. Mm-hmm. No tugging, it just it just, it just melt. 
like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was just talking about these earlier. See, I told y'all I love these. I bought two of them. These are the Ultra Beauty Lip Oils. They are really, really good. So I can put one in each purse. When I change purses, I don't have to change. And I use these every night. Every night or when I'm just walking around the house. Because you can't have no big crusty lips. You just can't. It, it won't be right to have big lips in that crusty. So, and this was on sale too. And then I got some Kish Lash Glue, of course. I like this adhesive. I don't know. I never tried the one with aloe. But I normally like their adhesive. And then we can get to um, the only thing remotely close to makeup that I got. I want to make sure I ain't lying to y'all. Was some Buxton glosses. I got. Um, which one is this? This is. Uh, pink champagne. That's what it looks like. And I'll swatch it. Right. Let me wipe that off. That's the oil. That's pink champagne. Oh, that's pretty. Girl, that's pretty. Mm -hmm. Girl, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then I got two of the new. I didn't have pink champagne. And I love Buxton Glosses. If you've been watching my channel, you know for a while. But what made me go over and even look for Buxton Glosses was they came out with this new... Uh, I don't know, coffee flavors or something to that effect. This one is pumpkin chai latte and this one is spiced vanilla. This is the uh, spiced vanilla. Let me swatch it. Right next to that. Oh, it's on there tight. Oh, that's a pretty brown. Like coffee color brown. That's it right next to pink champagne. Right there. Okay, I'll put it on. Here's somebody saying, mm, kid. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It looks like a matte lippy, but you really can't tell because I got the hood uh, on, yeah? And then the last one here is the uh, pumpkin latte. Pumpkin spice latte. I'm going to swipe it right there. That's what I could have did. There it is right there. Yeah. Okay. And that's it for Ulta. Whew. If y'all need a break, let the commercial come up. Go stretch your legs. Y'all, it's 28 minutes. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. I edit the crap out of it, okay? All right. Y'all, what is up? Did anybody ever notice these new bags from Sephora? I mean, they just, they trash. They trash. What is up with that? Okay, the first thing I grabbed is a Nun makeup bag. And the first thing I got in here is, oh, I got candles. This is Gingerbread Trap House. Ah, support a sister, support a sister from Forever Moved. Y'all know this is Jackie Ina's candle collection. And it smells just like gingerbread. But it's really, really tiny. Really, really tiny. But I think it was only like $15. $15. This smells just like Christmas. It smells just like ginger and cinnamon. and It smells good. Gingerbread trap pal. Girl, where you get them names from? And then I picked up the um, Open to Get Lit set. I think this was her earlier one of the first sets. Right? Okay. Camera cut off. Sorry, y'all. And it has four of the small ones, the same size as gingerbread crack, uh, crack house, <laughs> gingerbread trap house, <laughs> okay, except it has skinny dipped, uh, hey big head, grown folks, business, and we no link, hmm, we not linked, y'all the video long enough, I ain't gonna, you know, take them all out, but, I got these because it smells just like the review said, more like for Christmas and the holidays, and the holidays are coming. So, not only showing my support, but my house gonna be smelling, you know, good, decent. 
And then I know I went a candle fool, y'all. A candle fool. She got this new set that came out that says uh, Forever Move set of four 2.5 ounce votive candles. Again, Jackie, I know. I don't know what the the collection is. It just says Forever Mood. And I got a box of Bath and Body Work candles in there. Y'all! If y'all want to see them, let me know. And if y'all want to see that Victoria's Secret Hall, let me know. Okay. This is what's in here. Caked up, left on red, matcha business, and sh uh, cuffing season. Oh, I think these are the mini versions of her bigger candles. So in case you didn't know which ones you like and which one you want to try, you could get these. Like I said, support, support. It's all about support. You can't make it out here on own, y'all. We need support. And the last thing I got from her little collection is the Forever Mood. Uh, these are the newest ones. And these are the full size because I just had to get one full size. And this say Floor Play and Slip Happiness. If I can get it open. Oh, it's magnetized. Okay, it opens like this. All right. <laughs> she signed the little top Jackie Aina. And these are the candles. It says Slip Happiness and Floral Play. Let's see. Floral Play. Girl, it smells like a bouquet of flowers. I mean, a real, I'm about to give it to you to smell. This smells like a real live bouquet of flowers. Really? Okay, I don't know how it burned because I ain't never tried them, but that's exactly what it smells like. And then the next one I got here is Slip Happiness. Yeah, see what this smells like. Hmm, what are the notes in here? Girl, I can't see. I can't sleep. But I'm sure it's on Sephora. If you look on Sephora, you'll, you'll see the notes. But I don't know. That just smells new. It smells like something new. So I don't know. I don't know. I can't say much about that. All right, that's it for jacket and her camera. Okay, I got this adjustable slap. This bonnet. That this that the bonnet that's not a bonnet that's what it's called, girl. I don't know. I just never saw this on Sephora, and then it's got a little black girl on. I had to get it. I had to get it. Oh, okay. And it's got silk on the inside. Okay, and a little tie string if you want to tie it around. You know, to tie it around your head. Now I'd be worried about them getting lost in there. I'll probably put a safety pin on them too to keep them from getting lost inside the bunny. But I'm sure you don't even need them. Uh-uh, you don't. You don't. Probably when I got my little bald head out, I'll probably need them. And I'm sure they go in the back. I know y'all. I know. I was just trying it on to see, you know, how big head friendly it was with a whole wig and would it fit. And it's got a uh, grace. I can't say that. But it's got that little leather thing, little leather name tag stitched on it. And it's probably the makers. Grace, I, I, I can't say it. Y'all see it? Yeah, that's what it says on the little stitching. Mm-hmm. Modern protection that actually works. Okay. And then I got, which I don't know why I got this. I don't know why. What happened? I fell somewhere. Because I got all of these and I saw when it first released and I was like, I need that. And this is one of the things I probably should have put on my list for, oh, it's bougie, y'all. It's in a velvet. It's in a velvet bag. Okay, Pattern Beauty. I should have put, I was going to say I should have put on my list for the sale, but this is huge. It's got a nice rubber feel to it and these little cones y'all feel like a cone you can scratch your scalp real good with that oh 
And see, I thought this one was bad because it's thick. But girl, this one here is way thicker. Can y'all see that? And the comb is way more of a comb. Okay, I'm glad I got it. I almost stuck my foot in my mouth. And I'm going to have to put this little velvet bag up. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I had to put that up. <laughs> Woo! Okay. And the next thing I got here is Cinema Secrets. Uh, oh, Cinema Secrets came out with a lemon scented brush cleaner. It's the regular blush cleaner, cleaner that Cinema Secret has. Because I got a half a bottle of blue one over there. And I know why I got this one because it was in lemon. And you got a free, um, you know, the little thing you pour it in to clean your brushes with. You can't put them in there and expect it to stay because it evaporates. But, yeah. You more than likely have to use a glass container if you wanted it to stay. But, girl, this stuff clean your brushes like nobody did. If you had not tried it, girl, they got it in lemon night. Let's try it. <laughs> and then the next thing I got, y'all, this video is so long. And I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but y'all know I really like to talk for a long time, but people ain't got all day to be watching no videos. I know, I know. Let me move on. This is a, a Kaoli perfume. I thought I got two, but I only seen one in the bag. And this is... Oh, girl. It say red apple. Girl, I don't know. Kaoli Elixir 11. That's what it says. And I don't have any of these scents. So, this is my first one. Looks like the bottle is black. And I still can't tell y'all what it is. That's what it says. Elixir 11. I sound like it would have a cuter name than that. And it probably is on here, but y'all know I can't see. Perfect pair of vanilla plus anything. Y'all say elixir, citrus, vanilla, anything, milk, vanilla, white flowers, and citrus. I don't know. It says perfect pairs. Is that the name? Because I know I'm late on. Ooh. Uh-uh. I had to put that in here. I'm going to mix that with nothing. I know I'm late getting this. But I ain't trust it. Because I ain't know what it was going to smell like. And it's okay. I got to spray it. I got to spray it. I got to let that sit. I just smell like... I don't care for that too much. I don't know what that is. Maybe I got too much stuff on because I just smell alcohol. But yeah. This is the Elixir 11. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about that one. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I don't know. Okay. Let's keep moving. This is the last bag, y'all, and this time is about to be over. Now, this here, I don't know why I got it. I don't know why I got this, but I love these. These, I know why I got it. I know why I got it now. The minute I show it to y'all, this is the Laneige. This is for this upcoming season because it's got the great one and it's got the pink one that I don't have never had and never tried I never tried the lemon one but this is for this season and I was going through my stuff and I realized I ordered this one in January doing January sale but I got this one now so I just pulled this one out to say I gotta tell on myself but I love these I absolutely love these but I've been using my lip oil so much I kind of didn't get to it but $18 for a bunch of mini and y'all know $18 is more than the cost of just the one big regular size that's in here, right? See? No more explanations needed, right? Right? Okay. I got this uh, Peace Out Blemish Balm. Now, this is with Cecilia. It says it has sal uh, salicylic acid, niacinamide, hyaluronic acid, and 8 amino acid complex. Now I'm tell y'all, this is the uh, clean, clear skin balm. Wash away all impurities without stripping your skin. And now I got this because it was on sale. And y'all know Peace Out make those little things that go in your. It might still be on sale. Uh, make those little things that go on your face, or you know, and it clear up that. So I'm thinking. 
It might can get rid of my spots and dots. I told that box to up there now. <laughs> it might can get rid of my spots and dots. I was just thinking, you know. So, I grabbed it. And it looks just like bomb. No cream, no nothing. How do you use this? On wet or dry skin, gently massage a dime amount of cleanser in a circular motion on face and neck. Avoid eye rinse thoroughly with warm water. Okay. All right. And it's a bomb. I'm just saying that again, didn't I? It feels like cocoa cream. And it smells like, like air. I don't smell, I don't smell nothing. It don't really have a scent to it, so there's that. Yeah, I got both of the Fenty Beauty. This one just came out. And this one, I was fighting not to get it, but I had to because I have them all. I have them all. And it, it was a new cream blush. And they've been smart about this, y'all. This is the new uh, candy milk right here. Come on, pick it up. Yeah, this one right here is candy milk. It's new. Matter of fact, all of these are new. Because you got next to it is uh, Fenty Glow Fantasy. They put sparkles in there. Hot Chocolate Fantasy right here in the middle. And then uh, uh, Champ Stamp fantasy they put little sparklies can y'all see those little sparklies so i don't have any of these so i got duped and i wanted it so i got it okay now this just came out this popped up on my timeline was it friday or saturday and this is a new cream blush y'all the blush i didn't like because my skin too oily for blush but this is the only way you can get this peach pout and that's the new <sighs> cream lip. I'm going to be doing a how to the sale. Okay. <laughs> but this is what the cream peach pout looks like. Girl, let me let me do the right thing. I know you want to see what this look like by itself. Uh. Oh. Girl. Mm-hmm. Girl, this should have been out in the summer. Uh -uh. I guess it don't matter. We had the mask on. And these seem to last pretty good. Because I got a lot of them over there. A lot of them. But yeah, this is the new Peach Pout. And it's a cream. And I like it. Now this blush. I already know we're going to have a problem. But I'm going to open it. Because I'm too oily for blush. That's what it looks like. It's real, real. Let me hold it back. Can y'all see it better now? That's the truth to color. It's, it's orange, orange. And I'm telling you, I have tried, tried, tried these blushes that came, these cream blushes that have come out. But let me swatch it first, y'all. And my skin just too oily for cream blush. That's what it looks like. It has a little mirror in this little tiny thing. But... If you want to get this color, which is really, really pretty, you're going to have to get this set. That's the only way you can get it. And I think it was like $20, $25. Now, mm, I like that color, but like I said, I'm oily. So, we'll see. We'll see. I got it now, so it won't go to waste. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Okay, y'all. This is another thing out for the uh, season. Charlotte Tilbury. You get two. This is my favorite facial spray. As if you didn't know. This stuff will make your, your makeup last for hours. And hours. So you get two mini ones. Perfect. One go in my purse. One go in my desk. And I order another big one during the sale. To get me through to next year's sale. I'm just saying, this is the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray by Charlotte Tilbury, if I didn't say. I'm sorry, I got excited, and I'm trying to make this video not be an hour long. I'm sorry, guys. So sorry. And I didn't get that much makeup out. I really did. I really did. Oh, I knew I got two of these. This is the Huda Beauty 
Power Duo. Kaali, that's what it says. And I'm pretty sure this came out for the season. And again, I don't know the perfume shade. I just saw this like, oh, you get a free Huda lipstick? Let me go ahead and grab that up. Look how little it is, though. It's cute. I don't know what color. Oh, that's a pretty brown. Look at her. That is pretty. Let me swatch it on this arm. Let me let it down because I don't want to break it. Oh, that's a pretty mauve. That's real pretty. Okay. All right. And you get this and the perfume for the price of one. It says white flower. Deja vu. White flower. See how it smell better than the other one. I'm just saying, I didn't like it. I didn't. Oh, this smells good. I like this one. But I still smell alcohol. Maybe her perfume's got a lot of alcohol. Or maybe I need to let it sit there for a minute. But the first thing I smell is alcohol. Maybe it smells better after a while, but on initially putting it on, that's just what I get. I ain't going to lie to y'all. That's just, you know, that's just what it is. It smells like flowers, but you, you, you after it, that down, the alcohol dry up. Yeah, you can smell, you can smell a bouquet of purple flowers. How about that? Yeah. And then I got another uh, Buxton lip set. This is, of course, for the season. Right, white Russian is my uh, favorite, but they got white Russian sparkle in there. And then it has sugar, Eve is limited edition, and Holly. So, I'm thinking these two, okay, I'm trying to save time, y'all. But if you don't know what's the first, so what did I just really do for you? Nothing. Okay. This is Holly. I knew that because it's red. Go ahead and swatch it over here. Ooh, with glitter. That's Holly. This is Eve. That's pretty. That is pretty. So one for Christmas and one for New Year's. That's Holly. Right there, right next to Eve. These are the last two. These are regular collection. Oh, what was that I just said? Oh yeah, this is Eve. This is Eve. And then this one here is White Russian Sparkle. I love White, white Russian. It's one of my favorite ones. Put it on top. That's White Russian. Right there. And then this one is uh, sugar. Oh, honey. Sugar, sugar. That's some pretty new colors. Pretty new. This, this girl. Y'all know. Yeah. Can y'all see sugar? Right there. I know these swatches suck because I'm sitting at an angle. I ain't never had them give me this many darn samples. When I say it's a bunch, yeah, it's a bunch. Okay, three. <laughs> what is this? It looks like drunk elephant. Sugar, coffee, almond milk scrub, and a, I don't know, sea tango. That's what they put in there. But anyway, I got the Patrick. I mean the Patrick Star, I'm sorry, Patrick Star uh, Cream Concealer. What shade did I get? Too light. That's what it looks like. Medium Dark 3. That's what it says. Medium Dark 3. It looks like it's too light. Oh, that might work. That might work. Hadn't tried it, so I can't tell you. I don't know. And then I got the... Uh, um, Pat McGrath 
Girl, which one is this? Uh, Mothership 9? Yeah, it looks like Mothership 9. I can't see that. Y'all know my vision is horrible. And I totally skipped out on that collection. I, the, the, the newest one, I just skipped out on it. I totally did. So, I just, I'm collecting these, the regular size ones, and I'm cool with the regular size ones because I bought that little cardboard one last year and it arrived broken. They sent me another one and I may have used it once. Now, that's not to say when the sale comes that I won't get it. And then I got this Natasha Denona little mini palette. Um, what is this? The Z uh, mini Z Xenon? I don't know. But I wanted it because it was like a gray and black. Yeah. Xeno or something like that. Yeah. And finally, we are at the end. We are at the end, end, end. The Natasha Denona Retro Palette. Yes, I wanted this. I debated against this. I said no, and I said yes, and then I was like, just whatever, just get it, girl. So, and this is what I'm, I'm, I'm planning on sticking to. Just buying, you know the ones that I know work and that I know I love so I like it I know it looks like a lot of moths it looks like a lot of those palettes that I'm gonna get up and get together for my daughters which are the Morphe, Morphe palettes all those palettes all the Urban Decay the Too Faced and all of them got those burgundies those purples colors I already have but I'm just trying to slow myself down and switch over lanes with buying all that stuff Okay, y'all, if y'all made it to the end, who five, bam, I know it was long, but thank y'all for staying and watching. I hope y'all having a wonderful, blessed day. I hope it was anything in here that piqued your interest for the sale. Let me know, and I'll let you know how well I'm liking it when I get to it. Hopefully, I'll get to it before the sale. All right, y'all. Y'all stay blessed. I hope y'all having a wonderful day, a wonderful afternoon, and I just be happy, y'all. Stay blessed and be happy. All right. Talk to you later. Bye, guys.